Americans, this is your favorite alien and Boo Moose Bubba here on the morning of Sunday, September 6th, 2020, sitting in for Paul Harvey this morning. Stand by for the rest of the story. Mr. Paul Harvey did a story on a letter he got from the boss, a letter from God. And I'm going to try to answer that letter. Dear boss, the letter you sent that Mr. Paul Harvey wrote, uh, read to the Americans almost 50 years ago, where you said that uh, you gave free will and you loved your children here, but they had to make their own way in life based on the gifts that you gave them. They didn't understand what the gifts are, they still don't. It's the same type of message you sent to my people 5,000 of the earth years ago. Here they call them the Messiah or JC. We called ours the messenger. You gave us the exact same message and boy did they fail miserably as we failed miserably too. Except that they're still a step before us. Remember what happened to us? Boom. But we got some people that's still alive, that saved a few people. Well, we still lost 14 billion, boss. And you know that that is about the same as your other things, because we think that you were part of a, of a race called the Spreaders. You spent half a billion years spreading your DNA and your way of thinking all over the galaxy that we've found. 72 planets so far. 44 of them committed suicide. Boom. Because of the things that you tried to warn the Americans here with Mr. Paul Harvey. The factions. The religions. The way of thinking that the, in God we trust. When you gave them free will. But you gave them the knowledge that if they stop talking and listen, which most of the people probably do listen to you because I bet you if you're driving and you don't have your radio on and all of a sudden some voice tells you to put your brakes on or turn right or turn left and then you figure out there was an accident over there and I could have been killed. That's the way you talk to them, but they don't understand that, boss. They never did. We never did until about a couple hundred years ago when we found your civilization. So, boss, you see, this is the way the Americans are. They make politics, religious, greed, the accumulation of wealth, stuff that you railed against. Their priorities here. And until they stop, boss... And Mr. Paul Harvey tried his darndest in that letter that you sent him almost 50 years ago. Well, you told him that you didn't talk to Pat Robertson to force him to be president. <laughs> yeah. Or Mr. Jerry Farwell. If he's with you, which I don't know, he might be with the other guy. But if he's with you, tell him his son is about to say, bad. He has ruined the family name of Jerry Farwell. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, you see what I mean, boss? This is the problem that the Terrans have here, especially the Americans. They put their nation at war with itself. They got factions. I mean, factions are the pigmentation issues, the religion, the bigotry, the don't know how to handle situations. All that's come back to haunt them big time in the derriere. And they're in danger of disintegration. They don't understand that, boss. Anyway, I tried, boss, okay? And to you Americans, read Paul Harvey's A Letter to God and understand what I'm trying to tell you. Because my civilization went through the same thing, Mr. Boss up there can tell you. And numerous civilizations, like I said, 44 of them, who looked like you guys and us, blew themselves up before we were even a twinkle in his eye. This is your favorite alien. And Boo Moose Bubba, sitting in for Mr. Paul Harvey today, saying, listen to the boss, good day.